Hello everyone, so this is my visit to Beholden here in Houston. Uh, this first gown is called Roland. It's actually a ball gown, very pretty, nice train. It would have been perfect for the ceremony, but I just felt like it was um, a little too heavy for the reception. All in all, it was very beautiful though. Alright, so this dress has two ties in the back uh, that are meant to be crisscross. I didn't tie them, uh, I just wasn't feeling the dress, but I suppose that it does add a nice little touch to it. So this dress right here is called Tempo. Tempo is actually very comfortable, it has like this silk undergarment that's um, beige goldish I would say um, so the color of the undergarment obviously shows through the lace um, so even though the dress does look white in the video it's not it's more of a beige color um, it's very pretty also has a train my mom it wasn't you know white enough for her so this wasn't the dress either <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Reinhardt. Uh, Reinhardt, if I can say so myself, was very beautiful. The train as well as the back detailing and it had some detailing on the shoulder as well was um, much more beautiful than Tempo. Um, I still felt that Tempo was much more comfortable. Um, so this one didn't have any undergarment or a different color undergarment as Tempo, but it's still a very nice gown. This next dress is called Cameroon. It was made out of this silky material too, uh, but wow, it was like so flowy, <laughs> so comfortable, so romantic. I ended up putting a bling bling belt, and it was a thin one though, and it really made a difference. Um, I don't know, this, this dress is just overall comfortable and it flowed so beautiful, and when you walked, it just moved lovely, you know? This is Blake, everybody. So Blake made me feel like a million bucks, point blank. <laughs> This is Estelle. So Estelle had a longer train than Blake. Um, it also had some stringy back stuff going on. And then the V-neck was a little too deep for me. So that was a no. The name of this one is Harper. Harper had an even deeper v-neck than Estelle, so this is like an off the back no. Um, and then the material, something about the material, I felt like it was, um, how can I say it? Not so forgiving, um, if I could say that. So Heritage made me feel like a princess, honestly. The skirt was lovely and also like the the, the top of the dress, it, I think for me was 
the one that grabbed the most attention, you know? Um, so it was very lovely, but it also made me realize that Tuli is not something that I want in a wedding dress. Even though it looks beautiful on, it's just not for me. So guess who I tried on again? Mm -hmm. Blake. <laughs> so Blake made me feel stunning. Something about that off the shoulder, that simplicity look. Oh, I tried on Kaya. Um, so Kaya was this very, very off the white color um, that my mom wasn't happy about. So yeah, no. Um, anyways, thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned because I will be going to other places. Uh, again, this was The Beholding here in Houston, Texas. The young lady was very, very nice, very attentive, very kind. Uh, so I definitely had a great first experience. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching.